Gun shows are large events where promoters rent large public venues and rent tables to individuals and businesses to display and sell their products or services. Now, these sellers offer a wide variety of products for sale. These products include ammunition, accessories, holsters, and of course, guns. However, not everyone selling firearms at a gun show is operating under the same rules and procedures. There are three different types of firearm sellers that you will encounter at a gun show. The first type of seller that you'll find at a gun show is a licensed firearms dealer. These are individuals who have acquired a federal firearms license from the ATF to operate a business buying and selling firearms. Now, FFL dealers are required to comply with strict laws regarding the sale and transfer of guns. These companies are required to complete an ATF Form 4473, background check, and applicable waiting period for each person that they sell a firearm to, even if the transaction occurs at a gun show. Now, the second type of seller that you'll find at a gun show is a firearms collector, also known as a non-licensed dealer. These are individuals who have a large collection of firearms that they have decided to sell. Firearms collectors are difficult to differentiate from licensed firearms dealers because they usually look and operate exactly like a licensed dealer with some exceptions. Firearms collectors do not have to have a federal firearms license and are not licensed by the ATF. This means if you purchase a firearm from a firearms collector, you will not be required to complete any paperwork background check, or waiting period. This is because firearms collectors are selling firearms that they personally own and are theoretically not operating as a business. Now, I understand that a lot of these individuals are buying and selling firearms as a way to make extra money. However, they are prohibited from purchasing new firearms from manufacturers and wholesalers because they do not possess the proper licensing. The final type of seller that you will find at gun shows is a private seller. If you've ever been to a gun show, you've probably noticed people walking around holding a firearm and they have a, a sign taped to their chest or their back. This is a private seller who may have one or two guns that they want to sell through a private transaction. Even though firearms collectors and private sellers do not have a license to buy and sell firearms, that does not mean that they are operating without rules or regulations. These two types of sellers are still required to follow all federal and state guidelines for private firearm transactions. I'm gonna put a link right here so that you can watch a video that outlines exactly what is required when performing a private firearm sale.